feeling down? Uh, camp is winding down and I'm feeling uh, pretty good. It was uh, definitely challenging coming in as a freshman, but I was grateful to have really good coaches to have like a development um, as a player and uh, coaches were really good with that and everything. So. Coach Moore said uh, yesterday that he doesn't expect any of the freshman defensive linemen are going to redshirt. Is it nice to hear that? Yeah, it's nice to hear that, but right now um, that's like not really a situation for me. I'm, I'm really trying to get better as a person. Like, like personally, I'm just trying to get better as a player, rather if I redshirt or not. So I'm just trying to get better and uh, learn from the older guys, which are really helpful because uh, they know they've been there and um, yeah. <laughs> What's been the biggest adjustment for you? I mean, something you've had to deal with, maybe you weren't used to. Uh, everything. <laughs> everything was different. Uh, last year at my high school, we were I was a four-three right. defense, and coming into a three-four defense, it was really, it was really um, challenging. But again, thanks to the coaches, it was really, they're really helpful. They're really good at coach, uh, coaching at what they do, obviously. But um, yeah, it was really, it's really. Challenging adjusting and everything. Would you prefer to redshirt to learn more? Or? Um, you, I really didn't come in as a mindset of having to worry about if I redshirt or not. It's just to see if I can contribute to the team or not, and to see if I could uh, get better as a player. It seemed like early on they were throwing a lot of things at you. You were working with Oa, with the outside linebackers a little yeah. bit on your drops. Mm -hmm. um, it did it was a kind of sink or swim at the beginning. They just kind of threw everything at you to see if you'd be able um, to do it all. I'm pretty sure they just uh, wanted to see where I'm at and see what kind of player I am as for all the other freshmen and just to see what we are capable of doing and everything. So. What was it like dropping into coverage? Uh, I really liked it. <laughs> it was really fun because that's basically my first time uh, dropping into coverage. But um, anything to do to contribute to the team, it's, I'm available for it. So. Especially with moving to a 3-4 defense, you know, what are the things that you're trying to focus on these next few weeks? Um, I was really trying to focus on um, being that B-gap player and just containing my gaps and just not being always a contained rusher and everything. So just to be in that in the interior side of the the fields and everything. So what's your height and weight right now? Uh, I am six three and two fifty nine. Is that about where you want to be weight wise? Oh uh, yeah, I want to be, but more like muscle, <laughs> more muscle. <laughs> Is there a part of your game that's kind of that you that you know it's what kind of taking a stride these past few weeks? Um. Yeah, definitely. Um, my my pass rush and uh, thanks to Coach Tui and Coach Angus, it's been really been they really been focusing on my on every aspect actually. They just uh, they just seem to uh, like my pass rush and I am just trying to work work at it and work better, get better at everything I do. Well, thanks, Jacob. All right, thanks, thank Jacob. you.